All right, I got help this week. Nephew's back, Dalton. Y'all remember him from last year? He thought he was coming for a uh, relaxing spring break. No, <laughs> building houses. <laughs> oh, we're gonna hop on though, we for are. sure. We're for sure gonna hop on. So oh, yeah. we're back out at the Spruce Pine Project. And if you're asking yourself, Sel, I don't remember no Spruce Pine Project. What are you talking about? Look at, uh, I'll put a link up here, but uh, this is an actual build that we're doing for a client. Um, so the last we were out here, we were pouring footings, and now, ta-da! So there you go. This is all framed up. Sibylin, Sibylin, I'm probably massacring his name, but Sibylin Framing. They come out, knocked it out, had a full crew jumped on it so i have not been inside it yet it's the first time me checking it out quincy's running this project uh but i thought i would uh, come out and check it out with you guys and see what it looks like uh one of the upgrades we did the plan called for this to have wood post and uh instead we closed it all in with uh as you see with block and we did the skim coat i'm in here So I flew the drone, but I forgot to bring an extra SD card. I wanted to change out the uh, camera that we have that watches the place that's also doing a time lapse. So hopefully, uh, I'm not recording over the drone footage right now, but we'll see. Yeah, so it's got hot, you know, uh, ceilings. So we did, we don't like to do truss. Trusses, they're okay. Um, but we like to stick build when we can, so it's all, you know, we got engineered beams in there, um, little extra deals that we do. I like when a trade cleans up behind themselves, because I mean, there's a couple things here and there, but for the most part, this is pretty clean. Not just piles of cut wood everywhere. You know, everything's in the dumpster. As it should be. Did a Vantech flooring. None of that cheap, uh, what's that cheap crap they use? Press board, OSB. Yeah, none of that. So all Vantech everywhere. And one thing on this plan that we did differently is we added a bonus. It did not originally come with a bonus for this plan if you look it up online. So we did a bonus. It's a little dark up here, so we'll see. Oh, yeah, it's fine. We can see. Yeah. yeah it's a nice bonus area up here. That's a little half bath. Yes, yeah, so you just got like a little toilet and sink up here. And then plenty of attic space. So like with trusses, you lose your attic. So that's nice. It's a lot of attic space. It's a lot of attic. That turned out great. Okay. So you get that. So the next thing we'll be doing is we're going to walk through with the client about, you know, where they want their switches. You know, so if you're building a track house or you're just getting one of those builders that uh, just builds a whole bunch of houses, then you get it where they put it. <laughs> but with uh, us, with a little custom. And so with us, we're in the same price range as where the uh, track builders are right now and we're custom. So you get to pick the finishes you want, you get to, you know, think little things like the walkthrough of where switches are gonna go, if you want extra outlets, all those things that, uh, some, some of the guys do them, but a bunch of the big national builders, like I said, you just get what they give you, so. That'll be next, and 
Uh, all the trades will get in here now, so we'll have plumbing, HVAC, uh, you know, so all mechanical, so HVAC, um, plumbing, electrical will be in here next. We'll keep them on track. And then uh, insulation and sheet rocking, you know, all the stuff, keep rolling. So we're pushing pretty hard on this because there were a lot of delays with the uh, soil and some issues that happened with that. So uh, we're pushing pretty hard to get this done. So this is the one we cleaned everything up that was out here. Got rid of everything except for a uh, block and metal. James will probably take the metal off this week. Nice garage. Yeah, a lot of guys, they'll do the one door and then you can't even fit two cars in it. But you'll be able to here. You have a little bit of storage over there. Laundry room. It's out here on the back porch. Same deal. It's supposed to be, you know, your post and everything, but we finished it out with a block. So that's going to be nice. Yes. Yeah, it's, it's getting there. It's getting there. It's looking good happy with where we're at we framed uh they came back and framed this out uh for a fireplace yep so we'll have that and this wasn't here originally originally just walked in so she wanted it to be a little space it differentiates it a little bit so i mean to be without the bonus if we hadn't done the bonus i only think it's uh 1600 square feet 1500 something like that so i mean it's a great use of space that awesome for floor plan uh, I'm pretty sure that I'm going to uh, build this floor plan again. Pretty awesome. Mm -hmm. So uh, next time I do a video out here, will probably be, maybe we'll get some footage when they're doing the uh, install. If there's something you, hey, there you go. If there's something you guys want to see, this isn't my normal deal, right? Uh, but if there's something that people are interested in seeing, you know, I'll get some, get some footage of it uh, and uh, we'll talk about it. So until next time.